Hello and welcome back to Cyberpunk Adventure Snatcher. When we last left off, we have to look for a hospital that all of these Snatchers have been going to to treat their, essentially, skin cancer. Hmm. Well, it looks like our engineer friend here doesn't uh, know much about it. Where would you like to go? Hmm. Maybe we could look it up on the computer. You know, internet. Gillian? What? Harry suggested that we check the hospital using the Jordan system, but... The Jordan system doesn't offer a hospital search function. Really? Why don't we ask Napoleon? This is the computer room. Alright, fine. All right, let's use the video phone. Call. What number should I dial? Oh. 39. 5, 6. Come on, there we go. Welcome back, stereotype. What? You again? Sorry, uh, you'd prefer a woman, I suppose. Whatever. Anyway, how about giving me the password? The 100 day... Please input using the cursor. So... Um... 100 day rain, according to what we read in... The computer. All right, you pass, but we can't talk on video phone. I'll meet you in usual place. He hung up. What are you gonna do? Hmm. Let's see here. Yeah, what was Jamie's number again? Metal, can you give me Jamie's video phone number again? Thirty-nine three four four four. Ah! My God, a snatcher! Huh? Bet I surprised you, huh? Don't worry, this is just a tape. I'm at work right now. If you need to reach me, please call Neo Kobe Pharmaceutical Labs at 391009. Sorry to scare you. Bye! She really had me for a moment there. Since when did she start pulling practical jokes like this? 391009. No doubt a message is a strategy I've heard when dealing with your troublesome calling. So what is that supposed to mean, Metal? There's no need to be embarrassed, Gillian. I'm fully aware that Jamie has snatched your heart. What number should I dial? Anything just to get us this into our Rolodex. Neo Kobe Pharmaceutical Labs, can I help you? Huh? Oh, it's you, Gillian. What's going on? Sorry about that. I mean, being on duty and all. <laughs> um... Let's see. Well, let's talk... Talk about Alton Plaza. Let's not be, you know doing that. Yeah, about the answering machine prank. Jamie, that message on your answering machine, was not going a bit too far? Did I scare ya? You bet you did! Were you worried? Yes, I was worried. How worried? How worried? Well, re really worried, you know. Good. 
If you cut the jokes like that, if the Snatchers ever actually got their hands on you, I... I don't even want to think about it as a joke. I don't even want to think about it as a joke. Okay, Gillian. Hmm. You might know something about UV therapy. The Snatchers require a hospital which has facilities to treat ultraviolet ray exposure. Do you have any ideas about that? Well, having facilities to treat ultraviolet ray exposure is nothing rare, but we keep records here on the hospitals uh, on the island. I'll take a look at those. Don't get your hopes up. If it's a black marketplace running on its own, we probably won't have anything on it at all. True. How's your memory doing? Any sign of it might be coming back? Somehow, I feel like maybe I've always been doing this kind of job. I seem to remember wearing white. Can do you recall anything, Gillian? Jamie and White. Hmm. I'm afraid now. Nothing. Hmm. Well. No. 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 Yeah. Why not? Jamie, I'd really like to see you. When can we meet? <clears throat> Seeing you would just bring more pain, Gillian. Let's leave it at that. <clears throat> well, okay. Um. How's your job? Jamie, I've learned that the Snatchers have taken over a hospital somewhere on the island. I need your help in investigating this. All you have to do is ask, Alien. I'd do anything to help out. Nice. Oh, yeah, what about that photo? It seemed to be old somehow. Can I ask you one question? What? Remember that picture of you that I have? Yes, that's pic a picture of me when I was a little girl, right? Where was that taken? I don't really know. It looks like the Olympics or something. I wonder how long you've had that. I suppose I had it with me when the army picked us up. Yeah, the picture looks like it might have been taken at the Moscow Olympics. Moscow? When was that? A long time ago. Long before we were born. And that's all you wanted to ask about it? Uh, you see, Jamie, the picture looks like it may have been faked. Faked? Why do something like that? And why? I don't know, but they may be using us as our guinea pigs. What are you talking about? As if we're being controlled by something we cannot see. Well, oh, are you talking about me? Only us? Hmm. We're the only ones who don't even know about ourselves. Maybe the government knows something. Congress. Oh, let's just forget about this, Gillian. Let's just be ourselves. Let's worry about what to do from now on. Okay. Um... Yeah. Olene. Hmm. I think I might have heard of that. That might be a hospital on the island. Almost all the developments and administration of pharmaceuticals on the island takes place here. Okay. Well, let's, uh, let's say goodbye. It was nice talking to you, Jamie. Bye for now. If I find anything out about the hospital, I'll give you a call. Thanks. I really need your help on this one. See you later, Gillian. Bye. Well, not bad, and managed to get through a whole phone conversation without coming off like a terrible monster. Back to the front. We're at the reception area. Well, let's uh, move on out. Where shall we go? Enter the turbo cycle. Uh, take care out there, Gillian. We boarded the turbo cycle. Where would you like to go? Well, let's head to the plaza, because uh, that's where we're expected. All right, now heading for Alton Plaza.
We've arrived at Elton Plaza. What would you like to do? Oh, let's get out. This is Elton Plaza. I wonder if Napoleon is here. Hmm. Let's see here. Area. It's Christmas everywhere you look. Even Santa Claus is here. Santa Claus? Well, let's take a look at San Sanity Claus. A man dressed as Santa Claus is handing out tissues as an adver er, advertisement. Huh? That's Santa Claus. What's wrong? That's not the real Santa! Uh, Gillian, uh, you know that Santa Claus is- Santa Claus is real! Oh, oh, okay. Nothing. Probably just my imagination. Shall we check him out? Okay. Just don't draw your gun, Gillian, please. Let's check out this Santa. Let's check out the Santa. Let's go. Wait a minute. You're no Santa. Uh, how'd you guess? What are you doing in that outfit? What are you talking about? That's it! Ugh, I'm quitting this job. It's too dangerous. Somebody's after me. I'm gonna end up dead, just like, like Gibson. <clears throat> well, let's ask about the hospitals. I need some information about underground hospitals. Besides all the legit hospitals, there are scores of those underground places all over the city. You'll never be able to find them all. Well, yeah, but we're looking for one. Wait a second. You might be able to learn something about these illicit hospitals by checking up on a pharmaceutical orders. After all, almost all of the drugs used on the island are manufactured here as well. That's right, all of the pharmaceuticals on the island are distributed or manufactured by Kobe Pharmaceuticals. I got Jamie checking into, into it for me. Yeah, yeah, see, we're, we're up ahead. Hmm. Let's see here. Um... Sessions. Let's show them the thing we have. Olean Hospital. Yep. Can you tell me about it? Before that, why don't we take care of business? Um, okay. Money. Damn, take it. <laughs> Thanks a bundle. Alright. Now what do you know about this? May not be the one you're looking for, but I know an Olean hospital. Okay, where is it? Hey, I'm not doing this for fun, you know. You better have to do a little better than that. You got a cold there, Napoleon? Some kind of allergy, I guess. I always get this way in winter. An allergen that only operates in the winter? That could be Snow 9, you know. One can always pick up traces of Snow 9 whenever Snatchers appear. Yeah, it's just sneezing. It just goes on and on. Okay. Use some cash. Just as greedy as ever. Here, take it. Thank you very much. Okay, let's ask about the hospital. I don't know too much about it, but it's over in the RF district. Why don't you go check it out? Yeah, have you been around a bunch of Snow Nine lately? Here's a man-made strain that was developed by the military years ago as a defense weapon to help protect bases and like. 
Well, was all of it disposed of long ago? Yeah, but I hear that somebody started cultivating it again about three years ago. Three years ago? That's about the same time the Snatchers first appeared. Alright, I've had it. Don't call me anymore, okay? Wait a minute, Napoleon. I'll keep any Snatchers off your back. They're after both of us. You better worry about watching your own back. Oh, by the way, here. A little Christmas present for you. What? Tissues? See ya! Merry Christmas! Well, now he's gone. No surprise there. He's got plenty of reason to be scared. Besides, I got the information I needed. There's an advertisement on the back of that pack of tissues. This is an ad for Outer Heaven. Just how many different jobs does that guy have? <laughs> Outer Heaven! Okay... Well... Take a look at the people. Crowds of busy year-end shoppers are milling about everywhere. Hey, somebody dropped something weird here. That's a cigarette butt. Cool. Hmm. Everybody appears to be minding their own business. Nothing suspicious at all. Yeah, but you could be a snatcher among them, you know? That's true, but it's too frightening to think about. Napole Napoleon has gone home. Let's get over to Olean Hospital. A number of people are watching in front of the giant television monitor. Okay. Doesn't appear they're too worried about the snatcher problem. Okay. It's apparently a, um... Hmm. It's supposed to be another funny thing over here, and I hope it's a better than the last funny thing. Look, there is a ramen shop over there. Why don't we grab a bite? It does not appear that any tables are open at the moment. We will have to wait. Hey, 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 I got a table opening up over here. Have a seat. That spot looks good. Let's take it. All right, boys, what will you have already? Give me four of these. Why, two. Two will be plenty. That's all right, give me four. Really? Two? Two will be more than enough. And a bowl of ramen, too. Would you listen to what I'm trying to tell you here? My wife's always telling me, boy, you really have an appetite. <laughs> Let's just eat and then leave this place. Come on, Gillian, hurry it up. Come on. Mmm, good stuff. <clears throat> all right, let's go. I thought you could eat at this time. I won't ever touch that Neo Kobe pizza stuff again. Okay, see, that, that was that was a good, uh, funny bit. Also, apparently that ramen shop uh, person sounds kind of, I don't know, like New York Yiddish. <laughs> oh well, when we come back, we're going to be heading all the way over to Olean Hospital. Alright, now heading for Hospital Olean. Might as well get there now. Arrived at Olean Hospital. What would you like to do? And when we come back... Time to investigate this place. Have a good one, folks.